Hi guys, I'm Ben. Welcome to the Vintage Throwback. And um, yeah, you just saw a title where it said uh, uh, how to dress like a greaser in the winter. Um, I have done two videos like the last two years. Um, everyone will be asking me like, Ben, you just done a video. Why are you doing it again? Um, <laughs> well, because um, I saw Tom like doing like two videos uh, of how to dress like a greaser like in the winter. I thought, why not? And uh, this is kind of like more like an up to date kind of thing. So you, you could say I might do it like um, like a once a year kind of thing, like around the Christmas period and some shit. Do you know what I mean? But yeah, let's get right straight into it. Okay, for the starters, when it comes to dressing like a greaser, like in the winter, um, most greasers, as you know, uh, we all wear like t shirts, leather jackets, and all that. I know this isn't like a greaser t shirt because where it's got a print. On there, so it would be like a neo rockabilly, but again, like back to this. So, if you wore like a, a, a t shirt and a leather jacket, forget about it, you're gonna get cold for this. So, and therefore, we've got to think about layers. And uh, when it comes to like layers, um, you want to like, like for instance, like get a shirt like this um, because um, you can still like pull off the grease style by wearing like a shirt like this. Um, I got that from um, Lindy Lou's for. Um, like 35 pounds, fucking beautiful, isn't it? And of course, you tuck the shirt in. You can roll up the sleeves if you want, but when it comes to smart dress shirts, I prefer sleeves down. And um, that's not all that to keep yourself warm, but. This is our ideal as well because uh, it's like a dark colour, material is quite thick so it is kind of ideal to wear like in the autumn or the winter and uh, to finish off the touch, leather jackets. But if you want to still put off like the hardcore like greaser like style, uh, just pop up the collar like that. There you go, you're nice and comfy and uh, you're ready to like go out like dressing like this. But however though, you don't have to use like, a leather jacket like, to pull off the greaser style. Um, like my friend Teresa pointed out, uh, any other like jacket which is like rockabilly related, you can still pull off like, the greaser style by uh, wearing them other jackets as well. It doesn't have to be like leather jackets like this. Whatever jacket you've got which is rockabilly related, you can pull it off easy, like, just like that. And if your neck is uh, cold, uh, this is like the alternative option for it. Just like, stick a scarf on and um, like with how the um, the rockers like did like back in the sixties when they rode their mi motorbikes, so um, they wore them. This isn't. A, I've not got a white scarf, but I've got a plain one, which is like close enough. Uh, regardless of it being like super long, um, if you have like a shorter version of it, you can pull off the grease style by doing that. Um, <laughs> but don't go for a long scarf like that. It's just like a main example, and obviously go for white. You know, I haven't got one, so I can't really show you. So. Don't judge. And also for um, like jeans, um, it's better going for like dark colours. Like, um, even though it's just blue, it's kind of like dark blue, like Levi's. Um, because with darker colours, um, it sort of like absorbs like the body warmth. I don't know, that's science for you. And for the footwear, um, biker boots. You've always got to wear biker boots um, with um, baseball shoes forward slash um, Converse. Forget about it because Converse is like thin material and um, Micro Boost is like thick leather, so um, then you're obviously secure the firm of the greaser style. And so, yeah, that is the end of the video, guys. And um, I hope it kind of helps you and all. Despite that, my past two videos I did of the greaser style related like in the winter, but it's kind of more up to date, especially now I've got like uh, more things off the winter. But yeah, I'm going to stop babbling on and wrap up the video from there. So, you'll take care guys, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye now.